Hello and welcome to this video. My name is Mario and this is the first of a series of videos, video tutorials to on how to work with CATMA. CATMA is Computer Assisted Text Markup and Analysis. So in this video we are going to learn on how to register an account in CATMA and how to log in and how to recognize the areas of the dashboard. So let's go. Here, I'm here at katma.de. So in this first page, you can click on work with Katma. And this opens a, a next page where you can choose Katma 6 or Katma 7. So Katma 6 is still on air. We, we are today it's the September 9, 2023. But you can't crea cannot create new projects on Katma 6. You only have the old ones, uh, so if you have uh, an account on, on Katma 6, the projects will soon be migrated to Katma 7. If you want to start new projects, you can, uh, as of today, you, you must uh, register on Katma 7. So let's click here, and then you can click on sign up. It's a simple sign up. Um, scheme so you can uh, type your address email address here and click on sign up you receive an email to activate your account with a, a, a to set up a password or you can use uh, your google account to sign up in katma once you have done that you can come back to this page to katma click on work with katma again and you'll be back to this page but now you can click on sign in and then you enter your information, uh, username and password, and click on sign in. Okay, since you've done that, uh, once you have, have done that, you can see here the dashboard of um, Katma. Uh, the dashboard has uh, three areas. The first area is the, the main one, this white one where you can click on create new project. You can join a project if someone has invited you to join a product, uh, project. Or you can enter uh, an existing project that you have. Okay, they will be listed here in this area. Uh, the second one is this lateral menu, which is not available now because you're, you are not inside a, a a project not working on a project so this menu only is only available when you are working on a project okay and the third area is this uh, this uh, dark bar here at the top uh, in this dark bar you have a the Katma 7 here so when you click here you come back to the dashboard so for example if you are working on a project see the menu now is available it's activated and if you want to go back to the dashboard you can click here and you are back to the dashboard uh, and other uh, and oh here and also you can uh, manage your profile here clicking on the top uh, right corner and click on edit account you can edit your public name and that's only that you can't uh, edit your username or you can generate an access token. Um, an access token is used when you want to 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 give access for to your data uh, from a, a, an external system. So this system will be able to access your data uh, through this token uh, and collect all the the, the read-only access. They will have only read-only access to your data and your projects, so they can't um, change your project. So uh, it's yeah. So that that's uh, a possibility if you are working with other systems to collect data and and keep your data in other sites. Okay. And you can obviously log out uh, also. So these is these are the areas of the dashboard. And in the next video, we are going to, lear to learn on how to create project, join a project, and uh, the features of this lateral menu. So I hope you liked. Thank you for watching.
拜拜。